2,850 weeks left if I live to 90. That's 2,850 opportunities for me to make it happen. But it's also 2,850 times that I don't want to waste. If you take your life now, you do the math, how many weeks, days, even minutes do you have left? How many chances do you have before it's too late? You see, we count our age in numbers, but this is not the way we should count. It should be looking, how much do we have left? Because if you had 2,850 pounds left in your bank account right now, and that's all you could ever have, would you waste it? Would you waste a penny? Would you say, you know what, let me put it all on black? Or would you make the most of every penny and pound that you have? This is not just true of sales and business, this is true of life. People ask me all the time, Pete, where do you get your motivation from? What keeps you striving and pushing to help people and to make a difference? And to see the world and see what's out there and enjoy what is there for every single day and every single moment, even when you're tired. And I always say 2,850. And that's my motivation. That's what keeps me striving. I don't see it as a negative. I see it as abundance, I see it as something to go for. Because each time that I waste a day, each time that I waste a year, that just doesn't seem good enough for me. When there's so much when we just step into the driving seat. When we just say yes to life, instead of I fear my goals, I fear taking the next step. If we say yes to selling your product or service, if you say yes to influence, if you say yes to giving your best no matter what, it's incredible what you can achieve because even though it might, might not sound like much, 2,850, if you take each day at a time and you wake up and you decide or actually you choose your attitude, your mindset, even your body language that you bring to the day and you say, no matter what, I will take on the right mindset today. I will take on positivity. I won't let my challenges become who I am. I will overcome them. I will find a way, I'll find the people to surround myself with that inspire me, that make a difference in my life and I do theirs too. If you do this each day, it's incredible how 2,850 can seem like a lot. So what are you doing with your 2,850 or 3,000, even 4,000 if you're a little younger than me? Because 4,000 can be a lot. It can be somewhere where you can leverage and create a legacy but it's also something that can be wasted it's only down to you to decide if you make the most of each day that you have if you spend or should i say invest your time wisely to make that difference that you know you can i know there's something in your life where you say to yourself i can do better i can make a shift i can make a change but maybe you're going to this nine to five that you hate and you keep putting this thing off week after week. But every week you put off is another subtracted from that overall figure. The question is, how much are you willing to spend before you say yes to what you're really meant to do? You don't have to quit your job. You don't have to quit all your friends. But you do have to say yes to being the best version of you. And that starts right now, right here, saying I'll invest in myself. And I don't just mean money, I mean time. Invest in yourself in attitude. Invest in yourself in deciding in your mind that you will give your best. So that's the message I wanted to share today. If it inspires you even 1%, then my job for today is done. But tomorrow we start over again. Tomorrow to sell successfully to the world, it starts with selling successfully to yourself by saying, I can make the most of today. You spend today wisely do the same again tomorrow and the next day and you know what you'll have a day where you don't do great but you pick yourself up no matter what because at the end of the day another day is around the corner you just need to make the most of what you've got don't spend your time wishing and waiting invest your time becoming better investing in yourself and looking for the best in life because you'll always find what you search for so that's me for today I look forward to tomorrow. Feel free to share this if it's inspired you and I'll catch you in the next video.